we're going out to do random nautica today you probably heard all the hype on the internet so we're gonna try and give us a random ping close to the park hopefully it'll take us into the park so i think we're gonna try and get closer to the park and then generate a ping within walking distance and just see what we can find pugs unboxing <laughs> check it out all right there's that start we're gonna peel this off bang bang it says you fee 400 let's see eagle oh yeah Dialing profile baby <laughs> All right, without further ado, let's get to it. We'll get back to you guys when we get to the park as soon as we start a ping. And hopefully we can get a ping within this park. All right, so now, see it doesn't even show my location. I'm gonna redo it. Reopen it. See, now it's got us in a different spot. So Make it real small. I don't understand why we're on the other side now. We was over here, now we're over here. All right, hopefully we get one, because I'm running out of tokens. All right, we got one. It looks like it's in the park. Yep. All right. So let's go to our first one. Take the vehicle <clears throat> to the closest spot and then walk it. Okay. This sure isn't right because we're already. Oh, no, we're not across 90 yet. We still got to go over. Okay, I got it. Yeah, just starting right. All right. Proceed to the route. Then take a slight left turn. We are off the shot out of your window. Looking So far, first thing we find is this. This is our first ping location. And this is a rock from 1983. So this area is dedicated to the handicapped young and old, sponsored by Rockford Lions Club. Lions of Northern Illinois. So, so far that's what we found. That is exactly where our ping location is at. Tried to break into it. Right here, there used to be a dock right here. We used to go fishing down here all the time. Oh, yeah, that one hit on it. I don't know. No, you always catch carp right here. Hey, this is a little cold out today. We have one for in the park, which we would have to turn around and go back the other way to find. I think we have to go. Yep, you go down that trail out there and I'll walk up and around, or we could go and drive. I don't care. We can go whichever way. So what we'll do is we'll keep this point. We're gonna take a break, and as soon as we get back on here, GPS it. We will keep you guys up to date. How you doing? It looks to me like that ping that we just looked at is in the campground. All right, we got our ping, our GPS coordinates. We're gonna follow, we're gonna go back to the car to drive on the other side of the lake. But we are a little pressed for time today. So we wanna try to find something interesting at least. To see what we can come up with. So just a quick drive around on the other side of the lake. We're gonna park, and then we're gonna hike the rest of the way up to our coordinates. I 
I really hope I don't get no fucking ticks. I have to edit that out. I forgot no more F-bombs on YouTube. I don't know if you guys can see that, but if we're looking at our point, it'll be directly through the woods in there. So we gotta find a way to get in there. There's a trail right down here. So that's where we're gonna head. So we're gonna take that trail for a little bit, see how close it gets us and where we need to go from there. I'm gonna try to keep filming from here on out. That way you guys don't miss anything. Old school toys. See, now there's another part of that trail that goes this way. Yeah, where our marker is. Yeah, we're on this side with the GPS coordinates. So, so when we go down this way, it's going to be to our right. Kind of kitty corner. No, we're about walking right up on it. I'm just curious if it's going to show us something in here that we've never seen before. Yeah, it's already taken us on different trails that we never walk on. Because these look like, you can see that the vehicles come through here too to do service. It's either that or there's an equestrian trail. Alright, it looks like we're going to have to turn. Yeah, we got to walk into the woods, bro. Now that's pretty cool looking. That tree, that's a perfect arch from where it... It's broke, but it's bent almost in a perfect arch. So let's make that our entrance. Looks like we're going through the, the gate. I found our entrance. Check it out. What's the odds of something like that being right there? That's what I'm talking about. That's weird. That's why I said it's ironic that this is the way we have to go. Coming up on it. It's getting closer, but we're not quite there yet. Around all this brush is really close. We have to go straight, like right there by that. I was gonna say that tree, but there's trees everywhere. I know it. Okay, so right up here, over this log in this little clearing right here, is where the end of the ping is at. So we're gonna get right to the end of this ping, and then we're gonna see what we can spot or find. Keep your eye peeled around this area. Let's scout it out and see what's here. All right, so this is exactly where it has sent us. The only thing I see is a bunch of downed trees. I mean, everything. Everything is broke level. Like, look at that little twig, root, stick, whatever. It's broke parallel with that tree. I mean, I really just hope it didn't send me out here to get loaded up with ticks and spiders. Find the trail yet? Yeah, I remember right here now. All right, back out on our main trail. So what do we do? Do we want to start another thing? We want to find another one? All right, let's go, guys. All right, so we're gonna try and get us another one, generate another ping in this park, hopefully. So I'm gonna get it closer. That's as close as we can go. We're gonna go ahead and do, let's do an attractor and see what that brings. Your point is in the water. No, I don't wanna go in the water. We're gonna keep going until we get one. No true anomaly available. There isn't truly anomalous experience in your radius. Try again momentarily or try increasing your radius. Okay, maybe we can make it a little bit bigger. Okay, we got one. Crow Youth Group Camp. Is that going to be in the campground, you think? Probably. Alright, we're going to go ahead and start journey and we're going to go see what this one is. Okay, that's actually not too far from here. It's a 10 minute walk. We got a woodpecker out here with us, guys. Because that's where we need to go. So let's just keep walking straight and then take left. It looks like you can drive down and then it's got to it's gotta be over there. I know that it's the only cabin. It's the only cabin out here. I want to see where that woodpecker's at.
right now it's kind of like we're walking away from it. But this GPS is weird in here. I only got two bars. Check out this, dude. It's like the Riddler. It's like open. Let's see what these. Okay. So if we go left, this is going to be bringing us more to it. <laughs> Turn. That would be a cool one to come up here though, dude, and uh, create, let's create like a water rig for the GoPro, take it underneath the lake, and come up here on the raft. Yeah, it was right over here on the edge of the water. It's not right there, it's over this way, whatever it is. Okay, we follow this, this road, and it's down here to the right. On your right, generated point. See, that's cool, because now we can do it while we're walking, so we can actually have a walking GPS. Is it a boot store? No, that's a key. I thought it was a spoon and fork too, I was looking like, I wonder if we're going to the... Okay, so let's see the guy fishing. Kind of seems guy. Change the battery. <laughs> Got the harness. B roll footage. We're almost to our third anomaly. But my camera stopped filming. I thought my SD card was full, but apparently the cheap batteries don't last very long. So I'm going to pop the Canon battery in here. That's like a fucking pistol. You can shoot some pictures with that thing. <laughs> See, I don't know how many meters. Okay, we're right. This says we're already in the woods. So. You wanna grab that? I think I got something stuck in there. Well, check that out, dude. When's the last time you seen a beer can with a lid on it like that? That's an old school. Yep, doesn't even have a tab on it anymore. I'm surprised at how well it held. I mean, you can still see all of it there. No. It's like... Preserved. Aged. Yeah, the color difference is crazy. Hold it. They don't want to hold this. I'm not going to twist it and smush it. But, you know, you can tell where somebody had their fingers right in them areas. They squeezed it, twisted it, and smushed it, which is how you get it to go into that small can shape by hand. And with these... Somebody probably went back up in there, camp counselor or some kid, you know, sneaking off, went back up in there some point in time. Decided to get yourself a little a drink through, you know. Fucking Budweiser, man, that'll do it for you. You can smell it too now. Okay, okay guys, so we're not completely done yet. Check this out. We got this can right, so we're taking this back. Where'd that damn thing go? I just seen it. Right here. Check this out. Not only did we find the can, but we found the lid, or the tab that we think goes to possibly the same can. So let's so keep that and we'll look at Run this back real quick. What would happen is, is this would be attached here in the middle of this, right? And then they would get this, they would pop it back. Peel it, peel it off. off so and where did the little it. piece of, of metal go? So what do you think? Would you consider this random? Yeah, absolutely. Random as hell. I mean, the first thing, the first thing that we went to, or the thing that we went to, wasn't nothing special. We went in there, there was a bunch of down trees, we found the woodpecker, all that stuff. Then after the fact of walking back up this way, it brought us back towards where we're parked. Go this way. way. Go this way. And then we go up to where we camped at before, but we get off off trail, which is a spot that we've technically never really been because we don't go off trail like that all the time, especially in this area. Well, that's, this is why. It's because these are equestrian trails, so we usually don't take the equestrians because they're long. When we were in the middle of the woods, and it sounded like witches or something, really hyenas or not hyenas, coyotes, coyotes but it could have been anything. There it went. What was that? Oh no, that was my phone. Because oh. we parked on the side over by the campground, remember? 